Good evening, people. Well, we got a, little, a new talk show, but uh, I'd like it to uh, present something to you. I got a, a guy here from Wisconsin, and uh, he emailed me just to come on my show. So I'm going to interview him and see what he's about and see, you know, what kind of information can I get off of. Okay. So, uh, is this how you is this how you pronounce your name? John Lovenuts? Is that how you pronounce your name? No, it's Love Nuts. Love Nuts. Okay. Okay. Okay, cool. Well glad to meet you. Uh Glad to meet you, sir. My name is Johnny and uh I got my reality show, you know, the Watsons. You know. But I wanna ask you a couple questions. Uh uh, you are a very successful person in, in IBM, right? So how long have you been there? Oh, going on about 15 years. 15 years. Okay, okay so you is, well, see here, you a supervisor? Yeah, so I'm a supervisor. I'm about to be promoted. Cool, cool, cool. So what do you actually make there? What else are we going to make there, son? We're going to make computers. Okay. You know, computers. Or do you understand English? Okay, I got you. I got you. Okay. You small bastard. This is my fucking show. You gonna ask my okay, goddamn well, question, bitch? Fuck you and okay. your damn questions. And, and, okay, so let's go to the next set. To the next subject. You got three kids, right? You got three boys. Yep. Okay. One named Lucifer. One named Damien. And one. And one. <laughs> How the fuck? Damn. You come up with this shit, dude. <laughs> You got a fucked up name. You got three sons named Lucifer, Damien, and Satan? Yep. That's their names. Okay. Okay. So what's your wife's name? Hodestus? No, my wife's name is... What the fuck is that bitch's damn name? I keep forgetting that bitch's damn name. Whole bitch? That's what it says now. It's a whole bitch. I don't yeah. know if that's her middle name, first name, last name. I don't know. But that's, that's not my. We call her at home, whole bitch. Okay, but that's not my issue right now. Okay, so you were successful, man. I mean, you put all three of your kids through college, yeah. uh, and I was seeing on her, you got big ass house, a nice house. Yeah. You got two cars. Yes. Uh, I heard. Okay, that's pretty good. You know what I'm saying? I can eat your problem. But the issue I got that you're supposed to be a player. Is, it, 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 is that true? I mean, will you let the people know that it's not true? Shit, yeah, it's very true. I like fucking and every damn thing else. Okay. You know, my wife and that bitch, they don't, that bitch don't give me none, so I got to get it from somewhere. Okay, okay, okay. So basically, you're saying that you married, but you also cheat. Yeah, I cheat. Okay, okay. okay. What's wrong so, with cheat? Okay, so that make you a bigamist. I'm not married yet. See, I ain't married those bitches. Okay. I only fucked them. Okay. So. Matter of fact, one of the bitches is going to be pregnant. God okay. So I got another email in from. I don't know. Was I don't know. Was your spouse or somebody you know said that you was in a misconduct or sexual relation with. Some guy named Butch. That's not true. That is not true. That is not fucking true. That motherfucker's name is not Butch. His name, motherfucker's name was Earl. Okay. Okay. So, you, so basically, you telling me you had a sexual relationship with a man? I had a sexual relationship with a fucking transvestite named Earl. Okay. So you telling me you actually gay? No, I'm not gay. If you have just because I let another man go down on me doesn't make me gay. You fucked up. Another man go on you. You gay? You gay, dude? Sir, you gay? Uh, yeah, you just. <sighs> You making me have diabetes, sir. You gay. That's just plain and simple. But you got three kids by a female. And you had sexual relationship with a guy named Butch. 
He told me that you didn't tell me you're not I'm gay. Telling you his name was Earl, not Butch. Okay, okay. So how is your sex life with your with your your future fiance or your future wife? That bitch still ain't giving me no damn pussy. Okay. Mm-hmm. I can see why. If you fuck another man, I wouldn't give you no pussy either. Well, she don't know about my little secret life. So you got that much skeletons in the closet that you would hide this from your wife because you don't want her to know that... Yeah, that I'll fuck that, a guy in a split second. That you quote bisexual? No, bisexual. no. Let me erase that from the category of bisexual. You gay. You I are not fag. Gay. You're a cold punk. I am not gay. Is that what you're saying? Hell no, that's not what I'm saying. I can't help it if I like pussy and dick. You about the sickest motherfucker I see in my life. Why in the fuck did I have... So, did you email me to say that you want to get on my show? Yeah, I said it. Okay, so you want to express your feelings about sex relations or your thoughts about life or anything like that? Yeah, it's Shut up, I only want to hear it because, you know what, you making me get a fucking headache. You know what, you just actually made me in. Okay, now, let's go to this part here. How much money do you actually make a year on your taxes? Uh, it doesn't matter how much you make. I'm not hearing that either. So, you know what? You're not telling me. Yeah. One more question before you turn gay on me. What is the key thing in your life that you would like to do to change this world? Be thing. gay. That's right. Be gay. So, you know what? It's all good about that. Okay. Now, here's what I don't understand about this right here. So, you telling me that you got... A house, but you didn't actually leave it when y'all got divorced. You didn't actually leave it because you want to give it to somebody else. Why didn't you leave it with your kids? Because they ain't gay too, so I understand that. So you know what? That's all. Bitch, you don't deserve my motherfucking house. Okay, okay. Little bastards. So how about? So how's your family life? Sucks. Okay. So your family life. So, so basically what you're saying, you had a really, really, really rough life. You can say that. Most the family was totally dysfunctional. So you so you actually got... When I was 14, I lost my virginity to my cousin. Okay, so basically you got you got raised by wolves. No, not by wolves. That was my mother-in-law. <laughs> okay, do you do... Do you do any type of drugs or... Do you drink? Well, I drink a little. I do a little bit of meth. <clears throat> and I smoke a little bit of crack. Shoot a little bit of heroin. Let me see. Yeah, and I drink two fifths of fucking Jack Daniels every day. Okay, so basically what you're telling me, you just a, uh, you, you just a fucked up individual. So you just a all the way, a all the way around drug addict. I mean, don't nothing stop you. Are you scared it might jeopardize your job or your freedom or your life? Anything like well, that? I did go to jail once for DUI. Right. Are you Are you sure it was DUI? Yeah, it was DUI. It says yeah. it says her dick unit insurance. <laughs> no, it wasn't that. It was DUI. God damn it! Fuck y'all! God damn it! Y'all fucking Kentucky boys, y'all don't know shit. Well, you damn right, because, see, we don't fuck, we don't let people eat our shit. Okay, here's the next question. Are you a, uh, are you a United States citizen? Uh, yes, I am. Good shit, good shit. Do you have, okay, do you have any problem with the United States? Yeah, I do. Oh, just shut the hell up, cause I don't even want to hear it. I don't even want to hear that. Yeah, no, I don't even want to hear that, cause you know what? You give me a hernia. Okay. Next thing. Have you ever in life thought about killing yourself? 
Yeah, once or twice, maybe. Okay, so tell, so so basically, you telling me you suicidal? Well, everybody's suicidal. Right, 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 right. Okay. 